And I wonder if you park. Okay. In between the two parking lots, if there's a better trail. Yeah. Down. Well, here we are. Uh, we are getting closer to the river. We didn't really find a trail. There's the parking lot up there, well like the little lookout point um, where you can just park and walk over. Um, but anyways, we just brushed it down through the trees from up there, uh, went bouldering, and uh, here we are on this little toes, cliff man. ledge. And we got the stupid toe shoes on that you get crap stuck between your toes. They're not great on the rocks. And here's what we got to go down to get to the river. A sea of boulders. Um, we already went down a fair amount of boulder slide up there. Not easy when you're packing a paddle, a fishing pole, a backpack, and a 40 pound kayak. Anyways, over and out. Okay, made it down. Just barely sat my kayak down. Here's the beautiful Lower Mesa Falls right there, man. That was worth the hike. My knees are killing me, my feet are killing me. Don't even have real hiking shoes. See these Vibrams, not much more than a flip-flop. And uh, this is what we hiked down. All of this, you can't even see it all, but from the top of that cliff, clear all the way down here. And we just made it down. Really, literally, one of the hardest things I had ever done in my entire life. Um, so we're gonna be floating down the river here in these beautiful lifetime kayaks. Got some nice little rapids here. Never done anything even close to a rapid in these rafts, so we'll see how it goes. Isn't that waterfall beautiful? Great picture right there. I just have a feeling it's gonna be dark before we get out of here. What's up, Scotty? We're here. We made it in one piece. Never been so great, grateful in my life. Over now, man. Okay, just another camera shot of the waterfall here. We got Scott sitting here. Drinking a little bit, Gator Powerade. And what a beautiful shot there with the kayak and the beautiful Lower Mesa Falls in the background. Um, we've got, uh, got my kayak right there. And we're just about ready to launch here. And uh, these are some pretty good sized rapids. I don't know, this will be interesting. Uh, I don't know if we'll encounter some rapids this big further down the river or not, but right here, I guess we're gonna miss them, but there's still some pretty nice choppy rapids down here, so. I'll keep our fingers crossed, and hopefully this camera survives, and you'll be able to watch this video. Okay, we just went through lunch counter, and uh, this does not do it justice. We just went down the, I guess to the left of this rock, right? That rock right there, to the left of that. Came down there. Uh, a little more than what we bargained for. Didn't know we were gonna be going down lunch counter. But uh, yeah, to the right of this, those trees right there, kind of came down and went to the left of this rock. And I'll tell you what, it was pretty rough. Uh, I actually hit drug bottom about three times today and hit some hit the bottom pretty hard with the draft or the kayak. Are they good? So anyways, we got a little mini lunch counter to go through down here. Uh, so hopefully we make it through. I got just about buried in a raft and further up here. Got turned around backwards. Uh, I almost fell off. Uh, pretty big. Scott found some wild raspberries. Are they good? Yeah, the huckleberries are sour. The uh, raspberries are 
All right, well, I'm going to stop and then I'll take a video of Scott going down this rapid here. It'd be kind of hard with the sunlight hitting the water, but we'll see how it goes. Okay, Scotty goes, man. Man with the plan. <laughs> Can't be much worse than what we already went through. Uh, I'll tell you what, that lighting's just not that great. Too bad, hopefully you can steer clear of this tree branch over here. That looks like we made it through pretty easy. Not too shabby. Yeah, you made it. Cool. Well, let's get a rock and rolling, man. Over and out. Okay, we got Scotty. He caught a fish while we were on the kayaks, but we thought, well, we'll uh, take a video landing here. Not too bad of a fish. Biggest one we've caught all day. We thought it would be worth the trouble to Get a little video here. We're not even in a real special spot. Oh wow, he's nice. Real nice. Look at that. That's a real fish a real right there. Fish, man. Two feet of water is what I caught him in. Wasn't even thinking I was gonna catch anything. Caught three real small ones that weren't worth anything. This guy's. Let's get a here, let's put your hand on the other side of him so we can get a Better shot. There we go. Look at that. That's a fish right there. He's pretty good. Nice rainbow right there. He's got a pretty good length on him too, huh? Yeah, he is a good length, man. Let's see. Just sit tight, buddy. Oh, wow, he got hooked pretty good. You got your good. pliers. And we're just on a spot here on the river. Nowhere real special. It's kind of in a place where there's a, not too deep, a little bit of chop on the water. Actually, Scott, he's been doing real good through here. Unfortunately, uh, <laughs> I lost my pole somewhere on the river. I have no recollection of where it was lost, how it was lost, or anything, all of the above. So, it's one of those things. We stopped to fish and my pole wasn't there, so. You didn't have your pliers? I did, I just thought I could get it myself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> awesome, got some good footage of good fish. Pretty legit. You can tell I'm cold, camera's shaking. <laughs> Over and out.